Have you ever stopped to ponder how a seemingly peaceful place like the Indian reservations in South Dakota could be a battleground for the cartel's insidious activities? This is a question that's been echoing in the minds of many, as recent reports suggest a chilling reality. According to South Dakota Governor Christy Noem, Mexican drug cartels are operating within the state, endangering its citizens due to what she perceives as the Biden administration's failure to secure the southern border. This information, which comes from thedakotascout.com, paints a grim picture of violence and criminal activity, including drug trafficking, that is leading to an increase in murders in the Rapid City area. Noam asserts that traces of cartel activity can be found on South Dakota's reservations. She mentions a gang known as the Ghost Dancers, reputedly affiliated with international drug organizations. But the horrors don't end with drug trafficking. Reports suggest that these cartels are also using the reservations to run sex rings, exploiting the most vulnerable among us children. Why, you might ask, is all this happening on reservations? territories that are meant to preserve the culture and sovereignty of Native American tribes? The answer lies in the government's apparent lack of action. It seems that the crisis at the borders is not receiving the attention it so desperately needs, leaving these areas vulnerable to such criminal infiltration. This information raises concerning questions about the safety and well-being of those living on reservations. What measures are being taken to curb this rising tide of criminal activity is there a plan in place to safeguard the innocent from the reach of these dangerous cartels? These questions serve as a call to action for all of us. It's vital that we don't remain silent about this issue. We must share this information, raising awareness about the situation and urging those in power to take decisive action. The stakes cannot be overstated. The lives of countless individuals hang in the balance, and it is our responsibility to shed light on their plight. By sharing this information, we can make a difference and help to protect those who are most vulnerable. So spread the word. Share this video with friends, family and anyone who will listen. The power of awareness can spark change, and in a situation as grave as this, change is desperately needed. And remember, subscribing to this channel means you'll stay updated on this issue and many others. Together, we can make a difference. Stay informed, stay vigilant, and most importantly, stay safe.